Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a setup video for two comebacks happening mid-July. I'm going to have Hobie's first solo debut with Jack in the Box. I was planning to only collect like one photograph per member per solo album for BTS but um uh, I kind of want to get everything. <laughs> and then uh, for 17, repackage Sector 17. So I'm going to start with Hobie's comeback and then I'll get into 17s and I decided to put those together uh, just to save a little bit of time. And because this is going to be my last non-pre-recorded video until August, so I need to get those out, <laughs> but let me just get into it. All right, so I have already pre-made the templates just to save a little bit of time, but I will go through everything and I use uh, the white dragon shields to uh, make the templates. So nothing too fancy, but let me just get into all the information about this album. So it seems like we're not gonna have like physical albums, but instead we're gonna have the Weavers albums, which is uh, kind of the reason why I have decided to collect everything because it will be uh, uh, the only way kind of to support Herbie like in a financial way with his album as well as buying it digitally but uh, so I'm just excited to get everything and like you get a lot I think for not that expensive um, so you don't get a photo book or anything if you buy the Weavers album and they've done this with Seventeen and I think within Hypen and I think they'll do this with everyone now but Weavers albums are digital albums where you have a QR code uh, where you just like go into your Weavers and uh, you'll have access to the album but otherwise in terms of photo cards you get photo card A which is the same for everyone and then you have photo card B which is one random photo card out of two so I'm tempted to buy two sets because they're not too expensive to have uh, to hopefully get both random photo cards and then the reason I kind of want to try and pre-order from Weavers even though I'll probably will not be home when uh, these ship out is that uh, you have some Weavers pre-order benefits so you get one transparent photo card if you pre-order from Weavers and you also get a uh, photo card L holder uh, we don't really know what the L holder like the size of it is so I'm kind of just ignoring that but we have at least one transparent photo card and then which is the same for everyone and then um, if you pre-order before the 10th of July, there's an early bird pre-order benefit, which is a holo photo card. So this is kind of the reason I want a pre-order, <laughs> I won't lie. Uh, I really want the holo photo cards and that's also why I'm going to pre-order two sets, uh, not only for the random photo card in the Weavers album, but also because you get one photo card out of two uh, when you pre-order from Weavers for the early bird holo photo cards. So, uh, let me just put in all the templates and I think it's just going to look really, really cute. Alright, so this is why I made a space for all the solo albums because I thought they were going to be physical albums. But if we only have the Weavers albums, then I'll get everything for everyone because I think it's just like nicer. But uh, yes, yeah, so I'm going to put the QR code in here. And then I think that I will put the uh, set photo card here. And then I'll put uh, the random photo cards in the middle and here. And then I will put the transparent photo card at the bottom here. And then I will put the holographic pre-order benefits here. And I think it look really cute and it's a really nice and satisfying seven pattern because if it was only like uh, the Weavers album uh, photo cards, maybe I would have done a row three and do like um, Hyung line like one, two, three and then Magna line one, two, three and then have like Namjoon like in the middle and just, uh, you know, uh, have all of his stuff. But if everyone is only doing the Weavers albums, the Weavers albums are like $10.00. The only problem is with us shipping is absolutely insane. So I'll probably try to join a group order or I'll try to go through a KID and maybe order the 17 albums at the same time because I won't be there for that either when uh, they drop. 
So I will see, but yeah, uh, and then maybe I'll have one extra like photo card A and one extra transparent photo card. So maybe I'll put them in the corners here just to have a full nine pocket. But that is it for her base setup. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. There's only like a Weavers album. If they drop a physical album, then I'll get a physical album. But other than that, uh, I'm settled and uh, I'll get into the 17 setup now. So once again, I have already made the templates, but uh, all right. So <laughs> as uh, we know, uh, Faith of the Sun was not too long ago, but they have dropped the repackaged Sector 17 already. But there's not as much as for Face the Sun, thank God, because I still have not finished, uh, I haven't completed those collections yet. I'm almost done, but you know, uh, still. But I am excited for Sector 17. I think there's going to be four new songs and there's only two versions and a kid version. They'll probably do a carrot version and a Weavers album. But for now, <laughs> we only have two versions, so I'm going to focus on that and uh, pretend I don't know about the rest. <laughs> so... Oh, I don't think I've said, but I collect Ming Hao and Mingyu for 17, so I'll be uh, setting up for both of them. As I've said, we have two versions, New Heights and New Beginning. Uh, we obviously get a photo book in each version, and they're both 88 pages. Also, I think that in terms of the dimensions of the album, they are going to be like semicolon, but just a little bit thinner. I mean, definitely thinner, like more than just a little bit. <laughs> and then uh, we have one lyric book, which is going to be the same for both. And then obviously the CD. Uh, and then there's a Team 17 card, uh, which it is basically a postcard. And uh, there's one per version. I assume that it's a group postcard, right? And then for the photo cards, we get a... Uh, two random photo cards out of 26 for each version so basically you we have uh two photo cards per member per version which is ideal i think uh it's gonna look really really nice in this mini binder but also uh i just think it's going to be easy to collect right makes me think again of semicolon also, I haven't said yet, but I'm obsessed with the color scheme, blue and yellow. And they're kind of like different shades, but it really, really reminds me of TXT, the Dream Chapter star. And obviously, I have a very soft spot for that album. So, I don't know, it makes me happy to see that color scheme again. <laughs> and then, there's a random film card. So, you get one out of 13 per version. So, again, one per member per version. Uh, they look pretty long. Uh, so I guess they'll look like film strips, kind of, uh, but I'm excited to see what they do with that, right? Because I, uh, uh, I'm pretty intrigued. And then uh, there's also stickers. And I mean, the stickers actually look like they could be, they're a little bit taller than photo cards, but I think that they might fit in uh, the four pockets, but I want to see what they look like before like putting them in my binder. But if they fit in the four pockets, I definitely will. And we have one random out of 13, uh, two versions. So once again, one random sticker per member per version, which is nice. And then uh, there's uh, two posters, uh, one version each as well. And then there's the kid version, which I don't enjoy kid versions, kino versions, but uh, in this case, uh, we get a title and credit card, a postcard, a set of uh, basically they call it photo cards but they are uh, postcards to each per member and then we get one random photo card so I will set up for the kid versions I have not gotten this face listen kid versions yet I will see if I like them or not to collect them and then uh, I will uh, advise but I'll still set up for them just in case in terms of pre-order benefits for 17, I like to wait and see what they have, but I will be setting up for the Target exclusive and I'll be setting up for the Weavers pre-order benefit, which I don't think they've said is a photo card, but it probably will be a photo card. And then for the Weavers Aladdin fansign photo card. So let me just get into it. I only need to set up like four pocket pages for this, which feels uh, like such a weight lifted after uh, Face the Sun. <laughs> I'm sure I'll be adding a lot more, but you know what? Let's not think about it yet. So, okay, I don't know why I put these at the beginning. They should not be. 
kid version. Okay, so new heights. I will. I'm, I I did not do uh, all four templates for this because I know that you know I'm gonna get both for each, right? But here I have the new heights Ming Hao pieces here, and then the new heights Mingyu pieces here, and then I'll do the same for new beginning. I'll just switch those around so uh, my binder doesn't get too bulky in the same spot. Here we go. And then the beginning menu. And uh, then I'm going to put the kid versions. And uh, for now, I'm going to put the Target exclusive there as well. Uh, but I'll be moving things around depending on like concepts and stuff and what looks uh, similar and what looks nice together for now. It will do. <laughs> this is just, you know, uh, things always change around anyway. There's not a single group where I've set up a binder and uh, I've stuck to uh, that layout. So, you know, it's fine. <laughs> and then I'll put all the Weaver stuff together. And then the Weaver's fan sign. This is something that they've been doing since Attacker, doing like one Weaver's Pearl Benefit and then one Weaver's Fansign card. <laughs> Which I think is kind of nice because you can put them together. But yeah, so that's it for this setup. Uh, and that's it for this video in general. Thank you so much for watching. I have a bunch of pre-filmed video to post up until August when I'll be away. So I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you very soon. Bye!